Hello students, today I am again on the screen for explaining the chapter Acid, Bases and Salts of class 7 Science. Before watching this video, please press bell icon for the further notifications and subscribe our channel. So now proceed. Hey students, what is the meaning of acid? An acid is a chemical substances which can neutralize a base is called acid for example hydrochloric acid nitric acid these are the examples of acid means acid means the substances which can neutralize a base is called acids bases means a base is a chemical substance which can neutralize an acid for example NaOH, sodium hydroxide, KOH, potassium hydroxide, etc. Alkalis. What is the meaning of alkalis? Alkalis means a basis which is soluble in water is called alkalis. Students, not all the bases are soluble in water. Only some bases are soluble into the water and these bases are called alkalis. Only, only that bases which are soluble in water are called alkalis. Now we would like to discuss in detail. Hey students, first we start from acid. Acid, what is the meaning of acid? Acid means an acid is a chemical substances which can neutralize a base. Acid is a chemical substance which can neutralize a neutralize base. It's called acids. For example, H2SO4, HNO3 and HCl. Means hydrochloric acid. HCl is an acid. NOH means base. Acid is a substance which neutralize base. Means when acid react with base, it get neutralized into salt and water. NaCl salt, H2O water. So acid is a substance which can neutralize a base. NaOH kya hai? Base hai. Acid is a substance which can neutralize a base. Is called acid. NaOH ko neutralize is mein kar diya? Salt and water. Okay. So now physical properties of acids. There are four common general physical properties of acids. First, acids have a sole taste. Acids turns blue litmus red. Third, acid solutions conduct electricity. And fourth point is acids are corrosive in nature. So these four are the physical properties of acids. Acid having sole taste, acid turns blue litmus red, acid solutions conduct electricity and acids are corrosive in nature. So these are the physical properties of acid. Now students, what types of acid? Generally there are two types of acids. First is mineral acid and second one is organic acids. Students, in general mineral acids are strong acids. Or we can say that ki mineral acids all are laboratory acids. For example, SCL hydrochloric acid, H2SO4 sulfuric acid, HNO3 nitric acid. So these are the minerals acid or we can say that these are the strong acids. Second part, organic acids. Organic acids generally present in the humans and plant materials. So these are generally weak acids. For example, citric acid lactic acid etc and these are the acids are generally present in plants or natural resources so these acids are called organic acids or these acids are called weak acids so mineral acid is strong acids and organic acids are weak acids so now it is a very important point of view for your exam chemical properties of acid it is very important first chemical property reaction with metal Students, when an acid reacts with metal, it forms salt and hydrogen. Zinc is a metal, H2SO4 is an acid. When acid reacts with metal, forms salt. ZnSO4, zinc sulfate, it is a salt. It is a salt. Forms salt and evolve hydrogen gas. 
when any metal react with acid form salt and evolve hydrogen gas it is the first chemical property of acids second reaction with carbonate when any acid react with carbonate it is the sodium carbonate then it forms salt evolve co2 gas and water in this case sodium carbonate react with acids form nacl salt evolve co2 gas and water third chemical properties of acid reaction with base and these are very important reaction also because this reaction is also called neutralization reaction when acid react with base nah is base scl is acid when acid react with base form salt nacl salt and water next chemical reactions reaction with metal oxide when acid react with metal oxide cu is metal o means oxide copper oxide when acid react with metal oxides it forms salt and water now it is a very important common effect of acid means wo effect jo har acids mein dikhai deta hai kya hai all acids gives h plus ions in water yani all the acids when dissolve into the water it gives h plus ions hcl when dissolve into the water it gives h plus and cl negative as it is a strong acids either strong acids or weak acids when we will dissolve into the water it gives h plus ions hcl is strong acids when strong acid it dissolve into the water it dissociate into h plus and cl negative in case of weak acid acetic acid is a weak acid when weak acid dissolve into the water it also gives h plus and ch3 co negative means h plus ions dete hain all the acids when dissolve into the water it gives h plus ions so these are the main common properties of acids okay now students we will discuss bases what is the meaning of base a students base means a base is a chemical substances which can neutralize an acid For example, NaOH, KOH, NH4OH, MgOH का होल्ड टॉइस मीन्स सोडियम हाइड्रोक्साइड पोटेशियम हाइड्रोक्साइड्स अमोनियम हाइड्रोक्साइड मैग्नीशियम हाइड्रोक्साइड दीज आर आर बेसिस एंड अर्लियर वी नो अबाउट एसिड्स एस सी एल एच एन ओ थ्री एस टू एस ओ फोर और एसिड्स सो बेसिस इज अ केमिकल सब्सटेंस वेन रिएक्ट विथ एसिड इट न्यूट्रलाइज इन टू साल्ट एंड वाटर अभी हमने पहले पढ़ा था कि जो एसिड होते हैं वो बेस को न्यूट्रलाइज करके साल्ट और वाटर बनाते हैं वैसे ही बेस एसिड को न्यूट्रलाइज करके साल्ट और वाटर बनाता है एंड दिस रिएक्शन इज कॉल्ड न्यूट्रलाइजेशन रिएक्शन ओके सो ए बेस व्हाट इज द मेन जनरल प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ बेसिस जैसे कि एसिड में क्या है एन एसिड विच गिव्स एच प्लस साइंस वेन इट डिजोल्व इन द वाटर ऐसे ही बेस क्या करते हैं ए बेसिस विच गिव्स ओ एच निगेटिव आयंस इन टू द सोल्यूशन वेन डिजोल्व इन टू द वाटर जैसे कि देखो बेटा एन ए एच एन ए एच वेन डिजोल्व इन टू द वाटर इट गिव्स एन ए पॉजिटिव एंड ओ एच निगेटिव एस अगर एसिड डिजोल्व होता है अभी हमने बताया तो क्या देता है एच प्लस आयंस बट बेस जब डिजोल्व होता है तो देता है ओ एच निगेटिव आयंस एग्जाम्पल ऑफ अदर बेसिस के ओ एच पोटेशियम हाइड्रोक्साइड when dissolve into the water it gives k plus and oh negative all the bases you see all the bases gives oh negative ions when dissolve into the water as like acids bases also two types strong and weak naoh koh these are the strong bases but calcium hydroxide magnesium hydroxide ammonium hydroxide are the weak bases now chemical properties of bases first when base react with acid it form salt and water second when base react with metal when base react with metal it form salt and hydrogen gas and evolve hydrogen gas third chemical properties of base when base react with non metallic oxide it also gives salt and evolve hydrogen gas so these are the chemical properties of basis now student salt salt when an acid react with base form salt jaise ki nh kya hai base hai scl is acid when acid react with base form salt and water students salt there are three types acidic salt basic salt and neutral salt acidic salt means 
स्ट्रॉन्ग एसिड और वीक बेस से बना हुआ जो साल्ट होगा इस कार्ड एसिडिक साल्ट मीन्स एसिड स्ट्रॉन्ग यूज हो और बेस कैसा हो वीक तो जो साल्ट बनेगा उसे हम बोलेंगे स्ट्रॉन्ग एसिडिक साल्ट सेकेंड बेसिक साल्ट में स्ट्रॉन्ग बेस बट वीक एसिड से बने हुए जो साल्ट होंगे इस कार्ड बेसिक साल्ट और न्यूट्रल साल्ट में स्ट्रॉन्ग एसिड और स्ट्रॉन्ग बेस दोनों ही स्ट्रॉन्ग हो ऐसे जो साल्ट बनेगा वो कैसा होगा न्यूट्रल साल्ट जैसे बेटा फॉर एग्जाम्पल एग्जाम्पल ऑफ एसिडिक साल्ट देखो एस सी एल इज ऑल्सो स्ट्रॉन्ग एसिड एन एस फोर इज वीक बेस तो स्ट्रॉन्ग एसिड और वीक बेस से बने हुए साल्ट कैसे होंगे हमने क्या बोला था स्ट्रॉन्ग एसिड और वीक बेस से बेस एसिडिक साल्ट तो एन एस फोर सी एल इज ए एसिडिक साल्ट एग्जाम्पल ऑफ बेसिक साल्ट मीन्स वीक एसिड ये सिस्टिक एसिड क्या है वीक एसिड बट एन एच इज स्ट्रॉन्ग बेस तो वीक एसिड और स्ट्रॉन्ग बेस से साल्ट बनेंगे कैसे होंगे बेसिक साल्ट एज लाइक एज इन केस ऑफ न्यूट्रल साल्ट बोथ आर स्ट्रॉन्ग स्ट्रॉन्ग एसिड एंड स्ट्रॉन्ग बेस एंड इट इज कार्ड न्यूट्रल साल्ट सो दीज आर द एक्सप्लेनेशन ऑफ एसिड बेसिस एंड साल्ट थैंक यू स्टूडेंट्स